Here is a payment for $770 that I got from a method that I'm about to share with you in this video. There's a huge demand for this particular service right now. Look at this, I'm on Google Maps checking for painters in Hornsby, which is in Australia, but you can do the exact same method with any country, any city all around the world. Now, when we look for painters in Hornsby, let's do this live together. I'm going to click search this area and you will see that I've got a bunch of results. A lot of the painters around this area already have websites. So if we mouse over here, you can see that they've got a website, they've got a website, they've got a website. However, look at this, MP Painting, Sydney, Hornsby Shire, they don't actually have a website icon. And most likely this person has been thinking of getting their own website for a long time, they just haven't gotten around to it. So there is huge demand for these services where you can offer to create a website for them. And website creation with a method that I'm about to share with you only takes about 30 minutes to maximum one hour. The coolest thing is that you can create professional looking websites similar to the templates that you can see here on the screen in about 30 to 60 minutes. It's super easy and you can use AI to help you build these websites. The demand for websites is huge because every small business out there actually needs a website. And how do we contact this person? Well, you can do this with any type of business, but here let's review the results for Painter Hornsby. So you can see this first one has got a website. This second one has got a website third one has got a website. So just keep going through them until you find one that doesn't look like they've got a website. So now let's just search for them, MP Painting Sydney Hornsby Shire. And in this particular case, it doesn't look like we can find them on Facebook or anywhere else. So just keep going until you find another potential one. Okay, and look at this. So we've got this one here, Oki Oki Painting and Decorating. So I've Googled for them, Oki Oki Painting and Decorating Hornsby Shire. And look at this, we've got a Facebook page for them. So if we open this Facebook page for them, then guess what? We've got a phone number and we've got an email address. So this way you can get contact details of this business and you can approach them and offer a website for them. You can keep going, you can search for different businesses in different areas of your city. Then you can do the same thing, different businesses in a neighboring city. So the opportunities and the potential leads you can get for these are endless. Step two is offering your service. And to do that, collect a list of email addresses for the companies that you're going to be approaching. Once you've got the list of email addresses, you can jump over to ChatGPT. It is completely free. And using any of these models, so ChatGPT 3.5 is actually free. You can ask ChatGPT to write you an outbound call prospecting email. And you can see here that in the email I said, I'm trying to pitch my website creation service to a local painting company, make it polite, professional and friendly. So let's see what ChatGPT writes for us. You can shorten it, you can make it simpler, you can do anything with it to sound more like you. And once you're happy with it, just go ahead and email that pitch to this email address and repeat the process until you start getting some positive replies. Now, of course, you might be wondering why would anyone actually buy from you? And if this company really wanted a website, wouldn't they just go and order one from a web designer somewhere? Well, let me tell you something. Most of the services that I am now buying from providers are from people who approached me because every business is busy and personally I don't have time to go and look for different designers, for content writers, for editors and quite often I get pitches and if the pitch is good and sounds professional, I order that service just based on what turns up in my email inbox. Next question is how much to charge? So let's say you start getting some positive replies where people are interested and they're asking how much would a website be? You can do some research and the price that you're able to offer will depend on your location, on how much money you would like to make, probably on your age, on your stage in life. But in general, between $500 and $1,000 US is a good guide. You can see if you Google for average price to charge for a website. You can see, for example, here it says that most professionals typically charge between $50 to $80 per hour. So if it takes you a whole day to make a website and assuming it's an eight hour day, that basically means between $400 to $640. There are other answers that you can find. For example, this person here says that when they first started for a five page website, they were charging between 1200 to 1800 lump sum. Here is another reply. It says 399 or 500 
500 minimum, so you can choose your own price depending on your location. Once you find a customer who says yes and accepts your service, it's time to start making the website. For this, I recommend that you use hostinger.com, which will play two functions. First of all, it's a website service where your client's website will live from the point that uh, you created to the point that you hand it over to the customer. For that purpose, I recommend hostinger.com and the reason why I do that is because Hostinger makes it very, very easy to create the website. They've got a really awesome AI creation tool that will help you create the website. So to get access, just click the link in the description and you'll land on a page that looks similar to this and you can grab any of these plans, premium, business or cloud startup. I actually recommend to go for the business plan. That's the most popular one, has got the most features. And if you click on add to cart, I'll give you a special coupon. So here you'll just need to choose which period you want to go for 12, 24 or 48 months. You can negotiate that with your client. If you're simply building a website to basically just hand over to your customer, you can then go for 12 months. Advise them that they will need to renew their plan in 12 months time. You can also negotiate hosting for 24 or 48. That's totally up to you. The 48 month plan, of course, is going to be the best value per month. But the important thing is that when you get down here, just make sure where it says have a coupon code, you enter the coupon code that I'm going to put in the description. It's caffeinated blogger without the space. Because you will get an extra discount. So right now you can see the total is $231. If I click apply, that's going to go down to 208. So you've got an extra about 10% discount of this plan. And of course, if you're just going for 12 months, so the 12 month plan normally is $72 total. But if you apply this coupon code, then it's going to go down from 72 to 65. Fill out the rest of the information here, submit the payment. And next I'll show you how to build a website. After you log into your account, you'll see a screen that is similar to this. Uh, there'll be something saying pending setup. So just click through and click Click setup and what you want to do is choose create because you're going to be creating a brand new website from scratch. So we're going to go create and let's click next. And you've got two options now. You either want to use WordPress to create your website or hosting a website builder. I recommend for you to go with hosting a website builder because it has um, special AI technology that will actually create the draft of the website for you and it's really, really good. So let's go create with hosting a builder. For domain name, you'll want to have that agreed with your customer. So usually it'll probably be something uh, that's related to the name of the business, but you will need to make sure that you agree it with a customer up front and then enter this domain name in here. Over here, I'm just gonna say okiokipaintingexample.com. Uh, just for the purposes of this video. I'm actually going to click use temporary domain over here, but typically if you've agreed this domain, then you would just type in the domain that you're actually going to use. So I'm gonna click temporary domain, and here we go. We've got this let AI create your website in minutes, which is what we want. So let's click start creating. Okay, so here we've got Oki Oki painting and decorating, which is the name of the business for whom we're doing this website setup. For most local businesses, it'll be a portfolio because we just want to show the work that we can do. And now the important part, description. You will want to describe the project or brand in a few sentences because the AI will take this description and will create a draft of the website for you based on your description. And here is the description that I've written. We provide painting services to residential customers, houses inside and outside. You can read the rest of the description. Just be as descriptive as possible. Let's now click personalization settings. So this is where you can choose a few more options. Let's choose a modern style and for colors, let's say surprise me. So now I'm going to click create a website. Now you can chill out, grab a a cup of coffee and in a minute or two your website will be ready and voila here we go our website has been generated this is a draft and as you can see it is looking professional it is looking modern it has got the pages that were requested which is portfolio testimonials and contact everything is already done for you some of the images might just need to be changed, of course. And to make any changes is extremely simple. Let's say if I wanted to change this image here, interior painting services or exterior painting services, I would just click on this image, click edit image, then click replace image. And I've got a few options here. I can use AI images. So we can just use AI to actually create an image for us. I've got a few options. I can use AI to create a unique image. So I can just give it a prompt here 
or I can click on replace image and from here I can go into free images and just use the built-in library of images. Let's say freshly painted fence. So if we search for wooden fence, you'll get a bunch of images that you can insert with just one click. For example, if we like this one, Let's click that and click on add to page. And there we go, our image has been changed. There is also a bunch of other tools that you can use. So AI tools, there are image generators, AI writers to write the content on the different pages for you. The one that I just want to show you quickly is AI logo maker. So if you want to make a logo for this customer as well, we can say paintbrush and a heart and let's click create and it will create a few options for a logo for us. So that's pretty cool. You can choose any of these. Uh, for example, if we want to activate this logo on our website, we can download it and then upload it to our logo section. Okay, so here where it says logo, let's just click on that and we can upload our logo here. And here we go, we've got our website logo just over here now. Everything else is click and edit. So if you wanted to change any of these, you can basically just click into here and then start typing to change the addresses, to change the details on the pages. It's drag and drop, click and type, type interface. One of the things I often get asked is how do I get my customers to pay me? And for that, I recommend PayPal because that makes your customers feel more comfortable because they know that they're protected just in case something goes wrong, they can get their money back. So therefore they feel a little bit more at ease. If you're in a country where PayPal is not available, then you can just use bank transfer. You can also send them an invoice through Payoneer if your country supports Payoneer. When you're ready to hand over the website, the easiest thing to do is to actually just hand over the whole hostinger.com account to your customer. It should contain only their website for that, of course. And before you do the handover, make sure that you go into the billing area and you remove your billing in case you've got any of your billing information in here. Make sure that you remove your billing credit card. Let the customer know that they need to add their card for the next renewal. So the discounted links to Hostinger are just below in the description as well as my coupon code caffeinated blogger that will give you an extra discount on all Hostinger plans. And if you guys want to learn how I've been making money with short form content, you can grab free access to my training at fastervideos.com. Just type in fastervideos.com into the browser or click the faster videos link in the description below. And when you land on a page like this, enter your email and click this button, get instant $0 access now. And I'll show you how I've built my YouTube channel up to 468,000 subscribers, how I'm publishing shorts that are getting insane amounts of views, millions of views and hundreds of thousands of views so that you can copy this method and start monetizing short form content and make decent money just from short form content.